Hello everyone, I'm Sarah of Ridge Textures Crochet and welcome. Today we are going to learn how to crochet the linked half double crochet stitch. And here on my channel you can also find the video tutorials for the linked double crochet and linked treble crochet. Today we're going to learn how to crochet the linked half double, which is what you see here in front of you. It's a very pretty stitch pattern to look at. It is the same on both sides and it's not too heavy. The resulting fabric is a solid piece of fabric. So I think this would lend itself well to a variety of projects, especially because it's quite versatile in its stitch uh, multiples that it needs and uh, as well as its style. So thank you so much for joining me. Uh, for this tutorial today, we're going to be using a little bit of the Karen Times Pantone yarn by Yarn Inspirations, as well as a 5.5 millimeter crochet hook. You can find links to both of these items in the description of this video. Also in the description, you will find a copy or a link to the copy of the free written and photo tutorial for this linked half double crochet stitch. And uh, it's there for you in the description. So thank you so much for joining me. While you're here, I invite you to subscribe. Take a look around. This channel is updated weekly with free stitch tutorials and crochet patterns. Our stitch today is worked in rows. So you're going to start by making your slip knot and then chain a foundation chain. For this stitch, your foundation chain can be any multiple of stitches and then you can simply add one. So today I'm going to chain a total of 21 stitches. and 21. Once you have your foundation chain, you're going to start by working the first linked stitch. Now the first linked stitch in every row is worked the same. You're going to start by counting into the second chain from your hook. So one, two, inserting your chain, in, your hook into that second chain yarning over and drawing up a loop. You'll have two loops on your hook. You're then going to insert your hook into the third chain, yarn over and draw up a loop. You now have three loops on your hook, yarn over and pull through all three loops. That's your beginning linked half double crochet made. You're then going to begin the next linked half double crochet stitch by first inserting your hook into this middle horizontal bar across the previous stitch. So here I have the top bar, this middle one here, I'm going to insert my hook into that middle horizontal bar, yarn over, draw up a loop, then insert my hook into the next chain stitch on the foundation chain yarn over and draw up a loop. Three loops on my hook, yarn over and pull through all three. That's your second linked half double crochet made. Now for the rest of the chains along this foundation chain you're simply going to repeat that last step. So of the stitch before, insert your hook under that metal bar, middle bar yarn over and draw up a loop. Insert your hook into the next chain on your foundation chain, yarn over and draw up a loop. Three loops on your hook, yarn over and pull through all three. Repeat that all the way to the end of your row. Thank you. 
I'm now working my final stitch into row one. You can then chain two and turn your work. For row two, you're going to work very similar to how you worked row one. You're going to start by working your beginning linked double half double crochet into that turning chain. So into the second chain from your hook, insert your hook, yarn over and draw up a loop. Now into the stitch at the base of your turning chain, insert your hook, yarn over and draw up a loop. Yarn over and pull through all three loops. That's your first linked half double crochet made. You're then going to continue the same all the way across. So into that middle horizontal bar of your first stitch, insert your hook, yarn over, draw up a loop. Into the next stitch, yarn over, draw up a loop. I'm working under both loops of my half double crochet there. Yarn over, pull through all three. Continue that all the way across, chain two, turn your work, and that's all there is to working this linked half double crochet stitch. So thank you so much for joining me once again. Don't forget to subscribe, and I look forward to seeing you again next week. Until then, happy crocheting. Bye. Mm -hmm.